Welcome to Atlas. Atlas is a platform built at the University of Michigan that displays historic data about the U of M curriculum to guide U of M students, instructors, and staff in decision making. Atlas is one of the primary tools that students at U of M use when registering for courses. The data in Atlas is genuine U of M data, so it's accurate and trustworthy, and the platform has been built based on the feedback of U of M users. On this video, we'll take a tour around Atlas, starting with course, instructor, and major profiles, then onto the dashboard page, before ending with academic spotlights. First, let's take a look at a course profile. Course profile pages display data about an individual course, including current course availability, historic enrollment data, and student evaluation data. The data on course profile pages represents the past five academic years. Let's say you're a junior who's thinking about taking this course, Econ 251. First, you can see in the course sections when this course is being offered. Next, you might be wondering how much work this course is and what kind of students typically take it. In the course evaluation section, you can see that 8% of the course evaluation respondents thought that the workload in this course was heavier than in other courses, and that 90% of the respondents said that the expectations for them in the course were clear. You can see that the median grade of the course was a B+, and that 18% of students in the course got a B+. And you can see that this course is about 50-50 juniors and seniors, with just a few sophomores. Lastly, you could also see that most of the students that take this course are economics majors. Students love these pages. One student told us, it provides information you can't get anywhere else. Class size and co-enrollment data have been particularly valuable to me when crafting a schedule. Another student said, Atlas is an amazing tool, and I think that it should be the only place that students should have to stop by in order to do most of their schedule planning. Now, on course profile pages, you'll notice that there are clickable links to major profile pages and also to instructor profile pages for instructors that have taught the course in the past five years. Let's first click on one of these instructors to see what an instructor profile looks like. On the instructor profile page, you can see the instructor's overall evaluation data at the top of the page and then their individual evaluation data by course that they've taught in the table below. Now that we've seen a course and instructor profile, let's go take a look at a major profile. Let's search for the computer science BSc major using the search bar at the top of the Atlas site. Here we are at the computer science Bachelor of Science and Engineering major profile page. Major profile pages show data about students who have received a particular degree in the last 10 years. Imagine that you're a university administrator who wants to know more about the students in a particular major. You could come to this page to learn how many students have graduated with this major each year, common co-majors and minors for graduates of this program, and most commonly taken courses by students from this major. This page can give administrators, faculty, and students a ton of insight into the students in a given major. Users are also able to save courses, instructors, and majors as they explore Atlas. For example, if you're a first-year student who finds a major that interests you, you might want to save that major so that you can come back to it later when you're getting ready to declare a major. When you save something on Atlas, it will be stored on your dashboard page. So let's go to the dashboard page now. The dashboard page helps students plan out their path through the curriculum. For student users, the dashboard page features a quick overview of their academic information, including courses they've taken and what grades they've received. The dashboard also stores any courses, instructors, or majors that a user has saved in Atlas. Students can then make custom collections of the courses they've saved, like courses they want to take in a future semester or requirements for a graduate program. Once a student has declared a major, they'll also see in their dashboard the most commonly taken courses by students in their major. Lastly, before we finish our tour, let me briefly show you the academic spotlights on Atlas. These spotlights provide unique and interesting views of academic data from across the university, such as the largest courses at U of M, fastest growing degree programs, and professors who have won a Thurnau Professor Award for their teaching. That concludes our tour of the main elements of the Atlas platform. Thanks for watching. For more information about Atlas, please go to our About page.